Washington has more on the beautiful start to the season and the impact of some of that late season winter weather. Marcus? Yeah, Mary, thinking about last week, today we are very happy with today's weather. Could be a little bit warmer, but it's okay. Right now we're going to take a look at the WJZ Mobile Weather Lab. Temperature, you can see 49.8 degrees out here. A little chilly for some of us, but you know a lot of people say today was a great welcome to spring. The Monday morning sunshine beams down on the Baltimore area, showing off the colorful flowers waiting to bloom and the pollinating bees hard at work showcasing the signs of the season change, welcoming the first day of spring. I wouldn't have known uh, until you told me it was the first day of spring, but uh, it feels uh, pretty good. This is spring after all. We can't let last week get us down. As we welcome the first day of spring, we can't forget one week ago when the Northeast was faced with a massive snowstorm. You can still see mounds of the white stuff packed in many areas. A nor'easter impacted the East Coast, including hitting Maryland. The impact was not long lasting, but concerned many people. So we were fully ready. We had plants in, we had pansies in, and then it all just got cold. It all just got you know, miserable. <laughs> Greenfield Nursery and Landscaping is hoping last week's weather is gone and more spring-like temperatures are here for the season. Compared to last week, this is great weather and we're very happy to get the sun. We're happy to get the temperatures up in the 40s or 50s. And as Maryland weather reveals, give it a few minutes and the conditions will change. The sun will come later and I'll be glad when it does. And we will all be glad when the sun shows itself. It's almost coming through the clouds right now. But a lot of people say they are happy. Spring is here and they're ready to have a good time. We're live tonight in Druid Hill Park. I'm Marcus Washington, WJZ Eyewitness News. Marcus, thank you.